joy and teaching a pleasure. Here we are with the remote teaching and learning process to bridge the gap. Happy learning students. Welcome dear students. Let's learn one more poem today. Be ready with your writing materials. Standard 4, Subject English Poetry, Topic, Six Honest Serving Men. Children, it's not honest, it is honest. So we read, Six Honest Serving Men. In the last class, I have told you who is a poet. The poet is a person who writes poems. The poem which we are going to learn now is written by Rudyard Kipling. Before reciting the poem, let me tell you the theme of the poem. In this poem, the poet tells us that the young children are very curious and they have thousands of questions. They keep on asking questions after questions. They want to know everything around them. So the poet says, we elders should be very patient and answer all their questions. Generally, poems are divided into stanzas. This poem also has five stanzas. Let us all recite now. Children, do you know what is reciting? Reciting is repeating with proper intonation and stress. Songs are sung, poems are recited. So, now we don't sing, but we recite with correct pronunciation and intonation. Let us start. Six Honest Serving Men I keep six honest serving men. They taught me all I knew. Their names are What, Why, When, How, Where and Who. I send them over land and sea. I send them east and west. But after they have worked for me, I give them all a rest. I let them rest from 9 till 5, for I am busy then, as well as breakfast, lunch and tea, for they are hungry men. But different folk have different views. I know a person small, she keeps 10 million serving men, who get no rest at all. She sends them abroad on her own affairs from the second she opens her eyes. One million house, two million ways and seven million wives. Okay, we have recited the poem. Now, let us understand the poem. In this poem, the poet says, He keeps six honest serving men. Do you know their names? They are what, why, when, how, where and who. Students note, the first letter of every word is capital because they are all the names, they are the proper nouns. He also says that these six honest serving men taught him everything he knows. He continues. He gives them rest between 9 to 5. In the last two stanzas, he says, he knows a person who keeps 10 million serving men who do not get rest at all. Children, he keeps only 6 honest serving men but the small person keeps how many? 10 million serving men. Children, here the poet refers to a small child who asks thousands and millions of questions. Poor servants do not get dressed at all 
answering the questions of this little girl. Now it is the time to find the rhyming words from the poem. It is a fun to find the rhyming words. Let's find. Yes, first one. Men, when. See, me. West, rest. Then, men. Small, all. Eyes, wise. Yes, all these words are rhyming words because they are all ending with the same sound. Students, read the poem once more and answer my questions. Who taught the poet all he knew? Yes, children, answer. The six honest serving men taught the poet all he knew. Second question. Write the names of six honest serving men. Yes, come on. The names are what, why, when, how, where and who. Children, remember, write the first letter in capital. Third question. Who keeps 10 million serving men? A small person whom the poet knows keeps 10 million serving men. Children, you need to practice what you have learned. So, here is your homework. The homework is recite the poem and write it once in your book. Stay safe and be happy. Thank you.